30 state legislatures, including Iowa, are putting anti-transgender bills up for debate this year. Everything from sports to health care to curriculum changes are on the table. Local 5's Ryan Scott has an update as we wind down this legislative session. Over a dozen bills were introduced this session that, if passed, could impact the rights of transgender Iowans. 13 of the 15 were specifically targeted against transgender Iowans, and eight of those were targeted specifically at transgender children. Keenan Crow, the director of public policy at One Iowa, says more and more bills like these are getting airtime at the state house over the past several years. In 2019, only one piece of anti-transgender legislation was introduced as an amendment. In 2020, that number climbed to 14, and this year, 15 were introduced. At this point, none of them have cleared a committee, but that doesn't mean they're dead. They can be added to eligible bills as amendments or pass next session. Across the country, 2021 has been a record-setting year for anti-transgender legislation. 2019, um, there were 35 anti-transgender bills across the country. 2020, there were 100, and then this year there were 144. Here in Iowa, most of these bills were introduced in the House and co-sponsored by state representatives Jeff Shipley and Sandy Salmon, both Republicans. Local 5 reached out to them about these bills, and if they plan to continue pursuing them next session, they did not respond. In studio, Ryan Scott, Local 5 News, We Are Iowa.